Hey friends, what is up? It's C, the Earthborn Primalist, and I have a question for you. How far are you willing to go in the pursuit of what matters to you? What are you willing to do? Because ultimately, there's always something more that you can do. And often that, that thing that you can do that's more, the, the greater investment, almost the burning of the boats, that's the thing that determines whether you win or lose, succeed or fail. In, in what you're undertaking in life. So with that in mind and that being said, because I'm heading to the high desert to run a 250 mile ultra marathon and I live in Florida, one of the hardest things for me is gonna be acclimating to that, that high desert. So the race is often, you know, above 6,000 feet of elevation. I'm pretty well right at sea level. Now I have this altitude training mask that I haven't worn for you know, well over 12 months because it doesn't get a proper seal. It doesn't work. It's, you know, it's just I'm breathing in oxygen around the seals of the mask. And then the other thing is I haven't, I've got these mouth sleep strips that you tape over your mouth when you sleep, which forces you to breathe through your nose. It's all part of the oxygen advantage. Patrick McEwen, um, Butico breathing, it helps your body make better use of oxygen and it trains your body to work better at uh, you know, using the oxygen that it has. So there's a couple of things here, and again, I can't do that. Like I shaved this part of my beard to try and get those sleep strips in place and it just wasn't sealing for me. So this is my official burning of the boats. My beard, which has been a part of my life for a very long time, something that I have absolutely loved every minute of having and it's got to go. It's got to go so that I can appropriately condition my body to make better use of oxygen so that I can simulate training at altitude as best as I can. So let's do this. Ha! <laughs> Should just leave it like that, huh? Stop laughing. <laughs> Huge mutton chops. Y'all saw it here first. Don't mind that, but it's not staying. Wow, who's that? Hello, handsome. So, I'm going to tidy that up a bit, but you get the idea. Now, let me ask you again. How far are you willing to go for the things that mean something to you? What are you willing to do? What are you willing to sacrifice? Make sacred? Who are you willing to become? We always start the journey along the way without knowing whether we have what it takes to complete the journey. But on the process of the journey, we change, we become something more, and that enables us to complete the journey. It's the hero's journey through and through. My beard has been my identity for a very long time. That's not a super healthy way to live anyway. So it's probably good to refresh, time to get rid of it. When it comes time to go race, I'll start growing it again. Who knows? Maybe I'll like having a clean face. Got to get out in the sun and get some of this uh, two-tone face dealt with. But you get the idea. 
be uncompromising in what you want in life. Have a beautiful evening, friends, and I'll see you soon.